In order to understand the importance of time and why do we need time management, we need to understand or say go through a story. What happens here is Samir. Samir is a very lazy boy. And why he is lazy? Because he always postpones his work, postpone things that, okay, I'll do it tomorrow or day after tomorrow. Father, his father was quite worried and he tried a lot to make him understand the importance of time. Samir promised his father, okay, I will never postpone his task, means he is not going to postpone the work. So, this Samir is a very good uh, singer. So one day he won the singing competition. Actually, he got the first prize. So he was asked to collect the prize the very same day. But the problem is Samir, he didn't care. He has no importance for time. So he went to collect the prize the next day. But the day he was called, the prize was about the ticket to a circus show the particular day. Okay. Now, when he went, the ticket was already obsolete. So, the next day he went, the ticket has no value, the prize has no value. So, he won the competition still, he, he didn't get any prize. So, Samir now learned a very important lesson of his life that never postpone anything, do it today. And time is very important, it holds uh, importance in your life, is very important. So time is running. It never waits for anyone. Okay. So in order to get success, you need to understand time management. So time management is the ability to plan and control how you spend the hours, minutes, second of your day. How do you do it in a good way, well, plan and do all that you want to do. That means I'll do this this time, I'll do this this time. That is, for these 24 hours, you have made a timetable, your schedule. That is, six hours I'll sleep, six hours I will work. This time I'll do good work, exercise. I'll give an example. If you get a homework in your school, you'll say, okay, maybe after uh, this watching this TV program or talking to our family, I'll do this work at 9 or some birthday is there, you go there. But 9, 9.30, you're so tired, your eyes are not opening. So basically, you are not able to do your homework. So the best way is come from the school, do your homework, study, and then there are recreational activities. All those activities other than your future or making your future are only recreational activities.